Hey, what's going on, guys? Hey, welcome back to another episode of Bad Beast Barbecue. Hey, today we're doing two things. One, we're testing out the capability of the Rode Wireless Microphone Go that we have that we normally have pinned all over our shirts. I got it pinned up here on my hat today, so let me know how it sounds, if it sounds much better or if it sounds, uh, you know, good enough for the video, okay? But today we're going to be cooking ribs on the Rectech Bullseye for the first time, okay? We've been cooking on it. For quite uh, a few weeks now, we started to get the hang of this smoker slash grill, and I'm about ready to go ahead and give you guys my pros and cons of the grill itself, okay? But today we're doing some St. Louis style ribs. We're gonna we season them with this bovine bold from Plowboys. This is some good stuff. And uh, we're gonna toss them on at 225 degrees, and we're gonna see how they come out, okay? So my one concern would be that the heat coming from around the deflection plate uh, cook the edges faster than it cooks what's in the middle. Okay, so but we'll find out if it's all balanced out as far as heat goes or if they have some hot spots. All right, so hey, don't go nowhere. Check out this short prep work and this uh, cook montage, and we'll come back and we'll let you know how they taste and what we think about the Rectech Bullseye's capability on smoking some ribs. So hey, don't go nowhere. Wanna move my feet? Wanna drop my one? Wanna move my feet? Wanna move my feet? Wanna drop my one? Wanna move my feet? Wanna drop my one? All right, guys, so we're done with our cook. Uh, it cooked in about three and a half, four hours, actually, so a little bit faster than a normal smoker, okay? We did have it wrapped in butcher paper, as you saw. Sprinkled a little brown sugar on top of the bovine bowl just to give a kind of sweet counter taste to the bovine bowl, okay? It's got a real nice smoke ring, and then uh, so let's go ahead and see how tender they are and how they taste. Man, these are really tender. They taste very good. That little brown sugar on top of the bovine bowl 
really gives it a nice extra layer of flavor okay man it's got a nice bite through too you can see the bone can't clean from the bone without coming off the bone so this tastes really really good all in all i say this was a really successful cook okay so if you're interested in getting one of these Rectech bullseyes, check out the guys at rectechgrills.com. They have a fabulous line of grills. Also, I'll put a link in the bottom of the description block if you guys are interested in getting some bovine bowl from the Plow Boys. Okay, that I have used that quite some time, and that's a very good uh, rub. And uh, and that's about it. So, hey, thanks for joining us today. Like hey, like we always say, where there's smoke, there's fire. If there's fire then man, there just might be a barbecue there. Hey, as always, guys, hey, we'll see you around the smoker.